Look for the key using your witcher senses. Hmm. Damn it. Examine. Now, where would she leave? Not here. Not here? Could it be... Here? Key to Polly's home. Ah, uh, the key. Okay. You got it. You got it. Find anything? Yeah. I found it. Okay. Door's unlocked. Open. Oh, what a devil's is. Get out of my ass. Watch it. And leave the woman alone. <laughs> what the f She's my betrothed. But I'm not your property. That's right. I love her. I'll not let her sway her ass in his brothel. Whoa, slow down there a minute. This is clearly one gigantic misunderstanding. One I can clear up in the blink of an eye. Shove your excuses up your ass. Shut off, or I'll split your skull. Uh, yeah, let him explain. My friend asked you nicely, so please be courteous in return and hear him out, or we'll settle this another way. All right, talk. Hubio, right? Polly's told me so much about you. She said you're erudite and have an open mind. You said that? Well, there's a truth to it. My mind's the open salt, <laughs> but its open saltedness ends when my betrothed starts wagging her ass around brothels. Get out of here, both of you. Polly's not going anywhere. Let him finish. Let him finish. There's no brothel involved. You see, friend, Geralt just hit the nail on the head. For what you have there is the old publicity placard. Old? Very. From a time when my establishment was under different management. I, however, would never let any indecency take place in my cabaret. My very reputation precludes it. So, what's all this about? Your betrothed is a first-class artiste, and I want to offer her a position worthy of her talents. She's to be my choreographer, and that in turn means she'll receive a share of the proceeds from every performance she choreographs. You mean to say, coin? Oh, you're a smart and one. And fame. No flirting required. You have my word. Oh. Suppose... In that case... I knew you'd agree. It's settled then. See you at the Rosemary, Polly. Well, I'm off. I'll catch up to you. Well, it's kind of nice to settle things without violence. Oh, never expected that to go so well. Well, you handled it well. He did handle it well. You handled it well, Dandelion. Man was buddy in your hands once you called him erudite. <laughs> in negotiation, as in combat, the key is to find your opponent's weak spot and exploit it to the hilt. So, time to head back? I've still got to stop by Rotlings. Commissioned some new placards from him a while ago, but Hubio came across the old version. Plowing artists got some serious explaining to do. Yeah. Who is this guy? Who's Rotlick? Never heard of him? Hank Rotlick, famous portrait artist? Commissioned a portrait artist to paint your placards? Henry's an old friend, needed the coin. And I decided we needed new placards to promote the opening performance. Seats won't fill themselves, you know. Okay. I'll get the placards. You head back to the Rosemary. I'll go see Rotlick. You head back to the Rosemary. Or Priscilla will have my head. Really? You'd go? No. Said that for the hell of it. <laughs> Tell me where he lives. Portside. See you soon. That's it. Just portside. Oh my. Now we need to find Rotlek and get the placards from him. Let's take a look at our map and see where he is. He is up here. Uh, uh, we might as well just run up there since there's no fast travel point nearby. All right, is this um, armor open now? I mean, is this where the armor is? Maybe I'm in the wrong place. Yeah, maybe I am. Oh, well. Uh, yeah, I just wanted to sell something while I was here. 
a square. Actually, this is a different place, isn't it? Oh, this is, I, I've done this many times in this game. This is a uh, Hattori's place. So yeah, that's why he's, there's no armorer there. We have a quest waiting for us that has to do with Hattori, but it requires a much higher level than what we are now, so it'll be a while before we get to that one. So we'll just run over here, and I'm sure that this is just going to be as simple as picking up placards. I'm sure this isn't going to turn into some kind of other quest. I don't know if I've been to this part of the city before. The Golden Sturgeon. Well, that answers that question. I have been here before. We were just here at the starting of this episode, I believe. That's where that uh, fight took place. After we played the game of Gwent. Okay, here we go. Somehow Geralt knew exactly where to go. <clears throat> oh no, what happened? Aw oh, man, what's going on here? Looking for Rodlick. You ain't alone. Damn halflings in debt to half the city. But I'm here to scrape mine before the carcass is picked clean. There's not enough for everyone, so bugger off. Feeding times, first come, first served. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Can't let you steal from him. I just want some placards. Huh. Well, I think that he's Dandelion said he was a friend, so let's let's. I can't let him st let these people steal from him. I can't. You're not gonna rob him. Strange. Don't recall asking your permission. Get him, friend. What? 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 I'm gonna fight him? Oh, come on! Oh, come on! Not too late to surrender. Ugh, I don't. So we're we're gonna fight him. Oh, and I can't use my. Can't use. Ugh, can I use any of my signs at all? Because uh, they're hurting me. I can't use any. Nope, I can't use any of my signs. Well, this sucks. When well, they're gonna beat me? I can't fight. Look at this. Ouch. Yeah, he's hitting me a lot worse than I'm hitting him. I'm not doing any damage to him. Oh shit, if he comes up here, I'm in big trouble. Oh shit. Damn it. Oh crap. I'm in big trouble then. Shit, watch out. Oh, damn it, man. I can't fight. Don't know how it. much Rotlick owes you, but everything in this house is mine. Ugh, this is bull crap. Wanna get something back? Try the Vagal Bud estate. Rotlick's losing his last crowns at the races, I wager. Now get the hell out of here. Man. Ugh. Damn it. Now we gotta. Ah. I'm embarrassed. And we gotta go all the way to freaking Vagelbud's residence. <sighs> that sucked. I wasn't expecting to have to fight fist wise, and I suck at fighting with fists, apparently. Damn it. I'm annoyed. I'm very annoyed. Now this is turning into some big giant quest. Alright, let's run over here to Hyrax Square, and then we'll fast travel over to Vagelbud's. Uh, Darn it. That just really bugs the crap out of me. Oh well. What are you going to do? Well, what you're going to do is you're going to go to the Vagal Buds. Uh, but we are here in this square where we should find the armorer. And there should be a uh, merchant here where we can sell a bunch of crap to as well. Oh no, this is the book guy. Where's somebody that I could just sell stuff to? Where's this other merchant I see on my mini-map? Somebody out here. Where is he? This guy? There we go. Alright. Welcome. Welcome. Show me your wares. What have you got there? Alright, we have a bunch of crap to sell off here real quick. So a jump rope, that's kind of a weird thing. So, as you can see, it's been a while since I've sold off any of this stuff. 
need flowers. I don't need a skull. I don't need eight, eight rope ladders. I don't need five candles. I don't think I need bear hides. So I'm just going to sell all this stuff. Ashes. Look at this moron buying ashes from me. I hate that I have multiple of all these things. Well, here's this painting. I don't know. Maybe I'll hang on to that. Perfume. Don't think I need perfume. For whatever reason, I'm hanging on to that fist deck. I don't need these broken rakes. What? Oh, okay. We bled him dry. He ain't got nothing left. So long. Okay. So... There should be... I think the, the smith or armor or whatever he is is over here. Yeah, he's right over here. So let's just stop in here real quick. And we'll sell off a bunch of extra stuff that we don't need. Okay, so yeah. I'm gonna sort by price. And we'll just sell off all this crap. Wait, what's this plus nine? Oh my gosh. What the? You know what? So long. Are we not even carrying a sword right now? We don't even have a steel weapon equipped. Is that why we had to fight those guys with our hands? It was awful nice of them to fight with their hands against us. <laughs> I believe this is the steel sword that we're using. Good grief. Yeah, we we Yeah. Top notch swords. I think we got rid of our sword when we play fought with uh, Dandelion. Show me what you have. Okay. All right, let's sell all this crap. Just to free up our inventory. Uh, I'll keep that as a backup. Oh, this is that blunt sword. Okay, we need I wonder if we actually need to give that back to Irina. I wonder if it matters. We said we would. Eh, maybe next time we see her. Okay. So now we'll go over here to the fast travel point. So long. And we'll travel to the Bengalbuds estate. Travel to the Vagelbud residence. Oh, whoops. Uh, let's see. Talk to Rotlek. Has this quest text been updated? Nope, still not updated. Where is Rotlek? What a pretty place. Oh, he's underneath of us here. Oh, there he is. Seems you're a considerable sum in the red, but you shan't back out on that account, eh? You won't have much of a choice before long. Calm down, old sport. We can't allow that. Who'd I wager with then, eh? Listen. Here's what we'll do. We'll make one more bet. If you win, I'll pay your debts and we'll continue playing. What do you say? And if I lose? One worry at a time, old chum. Well, I have to place my bet. <laughs> Alright, what kind of trouble are you getting yourself into, Rotlek? You Rotlek? Henri Rotlek? Artist, painter, debtor, and martyr to my art. At your service. Dandelion sent me. Oh, yes. Tell him his placards are done and safely hidden away. Yet, alas, I cannot fetch them. Because a group of angry creditors has seized my home. Think I might have run into one of them. Or two. Then you know my predicament. And now, Count de Louverton has offered me the chance to win it all back. I'm to wager on a race. 
Who's Count de Louverton? Generous. Not just anybody could afford to do that. De Louverton is not just anybody. He's Duke Sam's youngest son. Sam of the well-known family of gem dealers. One debt more or less makes little difference to him. Well then what's there to worry about? What's there to worry about? This is your chance to settle up, get a clean slate. We've had a spell of bad luck lately. Should I agree to De Louverton's offer and lose, I shall be in bondage to him for all time. Hmm. Uh, I just want those placards. Or we could say Dandelion will have to live without his placards. We could pay off his debt. It's only 200. Or we could win the race for him. I don't know if we just say this. Listen, all I really want are the placards. Tell me where you tucked him away and I'll be out of your hair. Forgive me, I cannot. I hid them with family heirlooms that would work those barbarians lurking outside my home into a slavering froth. Then go fetch them yourself. I'll wait here. If I show my face there without coin, they'll beat me to a pulp. I must win back my debt somehow, else I'll never return home. Hmm. <laughs> Well, this is not an option. We're not going to say that Dandelion will just have to live without his placards. This is the easy thing to do. Just pay off his debt. Or we could try to win this race for him, which is kind of a dangerous thing to do. Because I think the last time I was here, I got my butt kicked. Um, I mean, 200 really wouldn't be that big of a deal. But it just seems kind of silly. I mean, why would, Dandel why would uh, Geralt do that? Then again, why would he do this? Um, this is probably more interesting, so let's try to win the race for him. Let's do this. I'll enter the race. You'll bet on me. Win, pay your debts, then give me the placards. You are that good a rider? Far from the worst. Go tell the Count you accept his offer. <laughs> what am I doing? Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, here we go. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Follow the yellow line. Okay, I'm gonna try to stay ahead of this this guy. Have to watch my horse's stamina though. I wonder how long of a race this is. This guy's staying right on my tail. <laughs> my tail. Get it? Don't let him get ahead of us. I wish I knew where the end was. Move. Oh shit, move horse. It's, it's, a, it's tough. Managing the stamina of this thing. I mean, it's almost gone. No, damn it, no, 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 no. I won, whew, that was close. Thank you. I, I never expected this. May I ask to what I owe this generosity? Let's just say I like to do a good deed from time to time. Can we get those placards now? I'll bring them to the Rosemary in time. Just as soon as I settle my obligations. Fine. See you there. Oh, the softer side of Geralt. So now we are to return to Dandelion. Oh, look at all these people talking over here. <laughs> look at all these different conversations going on at the same time. Okay, this is giving me a headache. We need to leave this place. Man. Uh, okay, so let's see. Whoops, let's see if our quest was updated at all. Uh, yeah. Wow. Um... Well, this text is here, but we haven't quite given him the placards yet. It says, with the Witcher's help, I was able to make my castle in the clouds a heaven on earth. I opened my cabaret and called it the Chameleon. Oh, if you'd only seen the pride in Priscilla's eyes when our hardworking dwarven remodelers hung that reptile-adorned signboard above our doors. 
What a tragic shame later events did not go at all as we had dreamed. Oh, okay. Spoiler alert. So again, they're putting the, the new text in between the old text. I cannot believe this does have been fixed. Anyway, it is break time for me and for Geralt because he's tired after riding that horse. So I'm going to break here. When we come back, we'll return to Dandelion and see if that finally completes this quest. And then after that, we may very well um, move on to... Where is it? This quest where we go talk to Dijkstra about what to do about um, Radovid. We may do that next time. Tune in to find out. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, won't you let me know by hitting that like button? I'd love to hear from you, so please feel free to leave a comment. And if you're not a subscriber, won't you please consider subscribing? Thank you so much for watching. I do hope you'll join me again in the next episode.